Hi there, it's Laura with the Pain Cure Clinic, where we teach people how to cure stress-based chronic pain and illness. If you started down a mind-body path to get better, you've likely come across quite a bit of information about meditation, some of which may cause you to feel overwhelmed or even intimidated. When we think of meditation, the image that comes to mind might be of a group of monks bending hours, not moving, and chanting in the dark. I'm feeling anxious just picturing during this. The thing is, meditation is a great tool for overcoming and sustaining a pain-free state. So what I'd like to do in this episode is twofold. Number one, demystify meditation. And number two, show you how meditation dovetails nicely with our three pillars of success for healing chronic conditions. Here we go. The English word meditation stems from meditatum, a Latin term meaning to ponder. Though we can't know exactly when people began to meditate, experts agree that the practice probably began many thousands of years ago, before the birth of modern civilization. So it's no surprise that the practice has taken on a sort of otherworldly mystical quality. But the goal of meditation for our purposes is actually very straightforward and practical. Your mind needs rest, feeding, and maintenance on a regular basis, just like your body. A cluttered, stressed out brain is not the path to a healthy body or a happy life. Now to share how meditation fits into what we call the three pillars of success for curing chronic pain. Number one, change your belief regarding what's generating your pain from a medical diagnosis to a stress-based tension myositis syndrome diagnosis. Number two, reduce the tension in your life. And number three, increase your physicality. Hooray, meditation will help you accomplish all three of these goals. Number one, calming your racing thoughts allows you to see past your doubts and accept that your life circumstances are connected to your pain. It's not a herniated disc. Meditation quiets the panic and fear that have been instilled by a wrong but scary sounding prognosis that you'll have pain for the rest of your life. Not true. Number two, clearly meditation is a great way to unwind your mind and relax your body, relieving the tension that builds up during the day. And number three, meditation may be practiced passively or actively while walking, hiking, or running on your own in nature. So when you let your mind wander during exercise, you're getting double stress relief. It all boils down to this. Calming your mind equates to healing your body. That's it for this episode. Remember to like this video and hit the subscribe button to stay connected to our channel. And to explore more about how to use meditation to cure chronic pain and other conditions, visit our website at paincureclinic.us backslash meditation. And while you're there, check out our free guide to curing any stress-based chronic illness at paincureclinic.us backslash about. There are links below. Thanks for watching. See you next time.